Hey guys, I'm Nick and I'm going to review today a really interesting product by Cadbury, an Australian brand that makes chocolate. They decided to use Vegemite as a flavour in, in their chocolate. At first I heard this and I thought, what? That's, that's really weird because um, usually Cadbury and chocolate normally uses things like nuts, fruits, uh, jelly, more chocolate in their chocolate, or honeycomb, violet crumble, or if it's a brand, they might use their other brands and incorporate it together. Now, it's really interesting. Um, usually, Vegemite is used for things like a spread on toast, a spread on bread, spread on um, maybe even croissants, but not in chocolate. Now, Vegemite is a black paste. It's really salty, and we normally use it to spread on toast in the morning for breakfast or maybe even lunch and a bit of butter. Now, we might use it for croissants as well if we get a bit fancy. Um, but it's, it initially didn't exist in Australia. It was actually brought in from the British and it was called something like Marmite or something until uh, a company decided to rebrand itself and call it Vegemite by running a competition. By, and it was won by two women in 1919 or something like that. But now it's already sold to America. Uh, so America now owns Vegemite. Um, so I'm going to show you that. Now, the packaging itself, it's, uh, it's, this is a limited edition um, flavor, so I don't know how long it will go for. But as you can see, it's yellow on top, yellow on the bottom, and red in the middle. Just like its, it's, uh, its jar as well. So it's running it's the same theme. So th those lines, I guess, represent the lid. Now, I'm just going to open it up. So these Cadbury normally um, has their packaging with plastic. It used to be out of cardboard and foil, but uh, I guess things are getting cheaper now if they use plastic. So I'm just going to open this up. So as you can see, the, the chocolate there, it's, it's quite round and it has, uh, it seems like it has space to put in the actual um, Vegemite. And uh, normally the chocolate from Cadbury are quite flat and it's solid. And uh, I'm pretty sure these, this is empty inside or they put uh, the Vegemite filling inside there. So I'm just going to break that apart and I'm just going to uh, cut that up for you guys to have a look. There you go. Here you are. And you can see right there um, that there's a... Uh, I don't want to touch it because it might go into my hands. But the Vegemite filling does seem a little bit watery. Now if you were to look at Vegemite itself, in, inside the Vegemite uh, jar, you can see the Vegemite filling is actually very pasty and thick, like so. And you will see that like that. And it smell, the smell is quite very yeasty because Vegemite actually comes from a beer extract. From the, um, they, they, they actually used the, the yeast leftovers from beer. From, uh, in Australia, we use it from this company called Carlton United. So that make Carlton Draft Beer. Now, if I was to you smear this over here, you can see the difference between the two. Yeah, this one's a lot darker and thick, and this one's a lot more watery. Now, I'm not quite sure. I was told that it tastes like salted caramel, but uh, I'm going to try it now and have a look and how, see how it tastes. So at first it tastes like normal chocolate because of the outer coating, but inside it's very salty, very salty inside. But you can't really taste the Vegemite. If I was to expect, if someone was to give this to me, I wouldn't expect it to be Vegemite, um, Vegemite chocolate. But there is a, hint, uh, a little bit of a hint there. If people were to say, hey, that's Vegemite uh, chocolate, I'm like, whoa, it is too. But really, it's not. Uh, it doesn't really taste like it. Now, on the note that people did tell me that the Vegemite chocolate did taste like honeycomb um, salted caramel, I did go buy salted caramel and chocolate. So I'm going to bring it over here. So just like the salted caramel and the Vegemite uh, packaging, you can see that this one's also yellow and limited edition. Now that's just a coincidence. I didn't even notice it was limited edition when I first bought it. But I'll open it up and I'll, I'll break it apart and I'll just show you the difference. Now the chocolate from the salted caramel is a lot flatter than the actual um, Vegemite. You can see that this is a lot more flatter and solid and this one obviously can break apart. I'm assuming that salted caramel actually had pieces in there of salted caramel and I don't, I don't think I could cut it up anyway but I'll try. 
and there you go. Just like that, you can see that this one only has pieces of salted caramel and it's not actually um, gooey uh, caramel that comes out. Now I'm just going to take a bite out of this and I'll let you know how it tastes. So there you go. At first, once again, it tastes like chocolate. But this salted caramel doesn't taste at all salty compared to the, um, the Vegemite. I do, I've, maybe it's because I already had the Vegemite and it's already overpowering. But the salted caramel tastes a lot more buttery and it goes very well with the chocolate. I wouldn't eat the Vegemite, um, the Vegemite chocolate from now on because I don't think it's that good. I'll probably buy uh, the salted caramel instead. Now, they do taste similar, but the Vegemite, um, the Vegemite chocolate does taste a lot more saltier. Now, on that note, I want to just get actual chocolate. I want to get actual chocolate from Cadbury, so it won't be the, be the same brand. And then I'm going to smear a little bit of Vegemite on top and see if it actually tastes like the Vegemite chocolate. And oh, if you have a look, it does look a little bit different from the salted caramel. The salted caramel seems a, bit, a little bit thinner as well, if you were to compare it there, like so. I'm not sure why. Um, it seems that, oh, right. You do get a little bit more chocolate with this, just with the chocolate on its own, but the salted caramel, you get about 10 grams less. And the, the original packet gets 200 grams. 10 grams. That's a block of chocolate, maybe. I don't know. Alright, so I'm just going to smear a little bit of chocolate on the original chocolate uh, chocolate one without any flavour. Uh, this bit there, that there, like so. And I'm just going to have it there. I might, get, I, might get, I might get a glass of water just in case I'm, uh, I might gag. The Vegemite on the actual chocolate does taste a little bit like um, a little bit like Vegemite chocolate. Uh, the actual Vegemite chocolate um, limited edition one. However, you can really tell it's Vegemite compared to this one. I think it's the chocolate that makes it feel like it's not much like uh, Vegemite. The chocolate taste actually overpowers the Vegemite a little bit. And there you have it guys. Now I'm just going to try to actually eat the Vegemite by itself. Now I don't recommend having Vegemite myself because it's so salty. Um, it's not like Nutella how you can just have it on its own. And um, a lot of people actually dislike Vegemite. So my brother, if the smell of Vegemite will make him gag. So, but once I, I eat Vegemite every now and then with my toast and butter, and we have a bit there. See, see how it goes. That doesn't look very good, does it? Oh man. Okay. All right. Yeah, it's not really great to drink. I mean, not really great to eat. See you guys next time.